So for starters, we've actually seen, as we dug into some data in the industry, we found that 82% of BIM users found a positive ROI leveraging BIM technology on their projects. But we also saw in another survey that 29% of smaller to larger general contractors and subcontractors actually don't bid on jobs that have BIM requirements. So why do we see a lot of teams still shying away from BIM requirements on projects? And the simplest answer, honestly, I would probably say it's probably still because of the lack of familiarity across a lot of teams along with BIM. So I often hear from customers that they don't have access to tools that really can allow them to engage with BIM data on a project, or even that if they do have access, there's a lack of BIM knowledge across their teams, especially if they have access to BIM data just through design tools. It can be really hard and cumbersome to really get into those models and really understand them within a design authoring tool. And there also is always the consistent struggles in construction of limited resources and more specifically limited BIM enabled resources to really support other team members and stakeholders on these BIM data workflows. And then, of course, these models are being built by designers and often they don't include all the rich construction information that's really impactful for downstream uses and things like work breakdown structures or leveraging different scope breakdowns by bid package. A lot of those design models don't have those right out of the gate. And often a lot of team members really struggle to ensure they're always looking at the latest and greatest data, whether that's from a plan set or models. Same goes across the entire project life cycle. So they're constantly changing throughout construction and we really need to make sure we're leveraging the latest and greatest project information. And lastly, field teams typically don't even ever get access to the model for a lot of different reasons, but it could really help them understand the project complexities even better than always just relying on those 2D plans. So ultimately, BIM teams really struggled to find a seamless way to empower different project stakeholders with actionable BIM data to make informed decisions and receive that even greater ROI across their teams. And a big reason for this is that many of the design tools are desktop based and are really complex and not to mention the manual tasks involved with static documents and spreadsheets are really tedious, time consuming and can often cause delays and mistakes. So this is where Assemble really can help empower more stakeholders on the project to be BIM enabled. So at a high level, Assemble is an extremely powerful model conditioning and BIM data management solution that enables BIM teams to organize, customize, and share model information with other key project stakeholders for a variety of different downstream workflows. And Assemble is also a part of the Autodesk Construction Cloud portfolio, and it really provides tremendous value in both pre-construction and construction phases of the project. And so for those of you that are unfamiliar, the Autodesk Construction Cloud is a powerful and complete portfolio of solutions that really empowers general contractors, specialty trades, designers, and even owners to really drive better business outcomes. And having the right information at the right time it's really essential to completing a successful project. So in order to reach that point, it is crucial all stakeholders work off of a cloud-based common data environment in order to improve efficiency, quality, and reduce risk across the project. So I'm really excited to share with you all that Assemble now actually leverages Autodesk Docs as their central common data environment, which also connects to other ACC solutions to really span the entire project lifecycle from design collaboration, model coordination, and project management. So this connection to Autodesk Docs allows Assemble users to publish Revit models directly from Autodesk Docs and even from BIM 360 Docs to Assemble without the need of the Revit add-in. So reducing duplication of efforts by leveraging the common data environment and really ensuring that everyone is working from the latest project documents.